And you're not bad most TV entertainment without bound. Hey there, welcome to Trending on Eniola Badmos TV. On Trending today, please shoot dead bystander during NSAS protest in Ogbomosho. Details in just a little bit. And all time favorites. A bystander was shot dead and killed in Ogbumosho in Oyo State, southwest Nigeria, on Saturday by policemen dispersing NSAS protesters. It was, however, unclear if Jimo Isiak was among the young Nigerians protesting against police brutality before he was shot. He was rushed to Bowen University Hospital, where he died while receiving treatment. Here is a video of where he was rushed to the hospital. See, see, they just killed this guy. 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 Pictures shared on Twitter, however, showed Jimo standing by the roadside many meters away from the policeman and he was unarmed. It is, however, unclear how Jimo was shot and at what point he was shot. His blooded corpse has however been buried and here is a video of his burial. Hi wonderful people, my name is Emiola Badmos and of course I'm using this medium to remind you guys to please subscribe to Emiola Badmos TV on YouTube so you can get to what different trending news, you can get to what different entertainment updates and of course all the news going on around the world. Guys, do not forget to turn on your notification so you can get to watch all of our content. Thank you so much guys and guys please do not forget that this pandemic in the lab, we need to take responsibilities and follow government rules by washing our hands. We should use alcohol-based sanitizer. We should maintain social distancing. We should use nose mask to be protected. Above all, guys, let's stay safe. Protests began earlier in the week in different parts of Nigeria over continued harassment of young people by the notorious special anti-robbery squad SARS and the protesters are demanding the disbandment of the unit. Members of the squad have been accused of crimes such as extrajudicial killings, kidnapping, extortion and intimidation. The Nigerian government had promised on multiple occasions to reform SARS and make the squad more accountable. But the promises have been nothing but empty chatters. The Inspector General of Police, Mohammed Adamu, last Sunday banned the unit from setting up roadblocks and from conducting stop and search after a groundswell of criticism. Days after protests began in different parts of the country, President Muhammad Buhari insisted the vast majority of men and women of the Nigerian police are patriotic and committed to protecting the lives and livelihoods of Nigerians. But many protesters and Twitter users accused Buhari and the police authorities of being oblivious to the real reasons for the protests. May the soul of Jimo Isiak rest in peace. We'll bring you more updates in line with the NSAS protest soon. Remember to like and subscribe to Eniola Badmos TV. Eniola Badmos TV. Entertainment without